first, you're going to go to canva.com. You have different options here. You're going to select use custom dimensions. Change this to inches. The width will be three. The height will be four. Off to the side, you'll go to Uploads. Um, I've already got some sea animals here uploaded, but you'll um, just whatever images you want, upload. I want all the flashcards to look the same, so I'm going to go here to Elements and go to Frames. I'm going to look for a square, which is down here, and it throws it there. Um, I've gone over back here to Uploads, and I'm just going to drag this into place. I went over here to text. I'm going to add this. Notice how it sort of fits your um, frame. I'm just going to center it by sight. So I've done that. So there's one flashcard. Now, if I want to recreate the exact same thing, all you do is that. Go back over here. And let's say I want this one. Um, I'm going to center it so you double tap and then move it over just a little. And we're going to change this to the word dolphin, of course. But just for this example, I've got one, two, three, four cards made, and I'm just going to finish with these four. So I'm going to go right here to download. You can change the title of it if you want, but I'm not going to do that. Download as an image. Here are my four cards that I made. Um, and I'm going to open up a new document in micro or not Microsoft Pages. This is Mac. You can probably do this in Microsoft Word or even a Google document, but this is pages. It should be basically the same process. You're going to create a table. This is just a two by two table, um, and I stretched it to fit the, the full page. Um, and then all I'm going to do is drag my images into this table. So once you've got that, you would print them. Um, cut them out, and then I cut them and then laminated them. And there you go.